And then I yeah, opened the so, episode before. It is Austin. It okay, reopened so last time because I, w- I re-listened to it recently to do the highlights. Okay. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of the Cosmic Cast. It's me, Irony Mai, a.k.a. Austin. That was Jacob, a.k.a. Cosmic Domino. He was talking about Jason, a.k.a. For sure, Jason opens this That is me. No, 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 this is Austin. I almost opened the... Not that episode. Because 57 was Terran, so I opened that, I think. Then we're at 58. Then we had 59. What episode number is this? And then Austin. So this is episode 60. It has to be Jason. Are we really going to talk uh, cosmic cast opening semantics right now? I mean, Wait, yes, no, it, we, we, we need to. Episode. We were doing this before, so if it's Jason, then it's Jason. Jason opened Wait, this episode. No, I didn't open the Terran episode. Jason did. Okay, sorry. I'm gonna it's, kill uh, myself. I'm gonna kill myself. So it is Austin's turn. So it is Austin's turn. Okay. My bad. Why we spend 15 minutes on this? All right, Austin, you're I gonna have to use my, my Why mic. Why did your audio sound like you me, okay? shoved your mic up your ass? <sighs> Man, I'm sensing a lot of tension here, guys. I think yeah, we should push been, this another minute. week. <laughs> it's been a minute. We we took a break. It you think we'd be refreshed, but we're we're more tense than ever before. I'm opening my energy drink. Oh. All right, Ari, why don't you start with uh, whatever you had to say um, about your uploads? Damn, that was a really weird opening from. Hi, Ari. It's me. Hi. It's 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 Jacob. Hello. Hi, Jacob. I heard that you're going to be talking right now on the on the podcast. Yeah, I am, dude. <laughs> Finally, I, I missed I'm, you, man. How, how, I'm, how I missed are you, you too, man? How I'm okay. Kids? I'm okay. Um, you know, I've uploaded a little bit uh, on the channel. How are the two kids? Videos. Oh, the kids, the kids, the kids. Um, they're dead. They died a long time ago. I don't know why you're bringing them up. You knew you, you knew they died. You went <laughs> yeah. to the funeral. I just you wanted... went the extra mile to remind him of the trauma. Did you you just want to rub mile. it in. <laughs> I just wanted to rub it in. Why the fuck would so, you do that? What's wrong with you? My kids are great. Uh, Jimmy Little over here, he just uh, got a soccer medal, uh, first place. Uh, and little and little uh, Tiffany over here, she um. You know, you son of a bitch. Uh, get <laughs> you fucking, started an OnlyFans, so uh, yeah, she's oh, locked whoa, in the whoa, basement. Whoa, being whoa, punished. whoa, whoa. I, I specifically said no OnlyFans when they were born. Like, I literally wrote it on the birth certificate. I'm like, do not start an OnlyFans. And then the minute she turned 18, Jacob. I have an OnlyFans. So Jacob. I kind of beat the shit out of her. Jacob, you shut can up. have her. Jacob, okay, stop. this bit is bad. It's It, it went, it kept, it kept going. All right, uh, Ari, do you want to, you want to take it from here? <clears throat> yep. <clears throat> I don't what think we should ever skip a week again. Otherwise, this will happen. Okay. Um, okay. Hi, it's me, Ari. I am supposed to be the one who was talking, and Jacob so rudely interrupted. My apologies. But, uh, no problem, no problem. Listen up. Listen up, chat. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I got you. I'm here. I Why am I go. acting like I'm streaming? Anyway. So, yeah, uh, the YouTube channel, You're not streaming, my YouTube so not channel. <laughs> I don't eat every stream, you fuck. You hey, guys. absolute liar, here. bastard. Eating some chicken nuggets. Playing shut, Fallout. <laughs> shut the fuck mm-hmm. up. You know I don't. Oh, I did shit, not artillery. eat last stream. I did not eat last stream. Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Super Gaming Dude, or should I say Super Eating Dude? <laughs> I did not eat last stream, so uh, got him. you're fucking... Are you listening? Are you guys listening? Because I did not eat last stream, so I don't you know, know what I the got, fuck you're talking about. You know, about. quite frankly, Austin, that was a really good bit. I have to thank you for that. You made my day. Y'all even hear me, you fucks? N- yes. I'm saying yes. that I didn't even eat last stream, so your hypothesis about me eating every stream is a complete false, a false lie. Okay, it's a lie. if I'm being if I'm being a hundred percent honest with you, I do recall there being a grilled cheese involved. I uh, made grilled yikes. cheese before the stream started and ate it, you idiot. Yeah, but we have no way to verify that. So basically, what do you Ari mean? Ate on stream. The fuck do you mean? You have no way of verifying it. I literally said it happened. But I don't believe you. So you need proof that I ate a sandwich before the stream started? To be quite frank Wait, hold on. That doesn't even fucking matter because I didn't eat anything on the stream. Are you sure about that? Yeah, You can't hear shit. But, okay, we're circling here because I just said that I don't don't believe you. You you know, there's no proof of this. No, No proof that I didn't eat anything on stream? Yes. Watch the fucking stream then, you idiot. I can't. The, the the stream ended like a few days ago. You can rewatch it. It's still on the channel. 
Yeah, it's I'm not going to watch the VOD back. Um, then you're you're just straight up not you're just refusing to look it up. You're refusing to look up the information. Look, just because I'm a flat earther and I don't look oh up whether God. or not the earth is round <laughs> does not mean that I need to go back and watch your podcast to know whether or not you ate a grilled cheese sandwich. Thank you. That's one what of your greatest have, what, sentences, Jacob. <laughs> <laughs> I'm do you so want to? Do you actually want to go though? <laughs> do you want to say what I'm, you're going to say I'm like so twenty minutes ago? You know, you. I'm so wait, you know, you. one of these days we're going to be recording this podcast IRL, and Aries actually going to be able to beat you up, Jacob. You better, yes. you better knock this off, you know, or you're going to get in real trouble. Hesitate. For I real, I will not hesitate, buddy. Huh? You know, I used to, um, I used to pee less often. But now every time I drink a sip of water, I pee. What happened? Okay. Did I answer yep, we let that joke. We let that joke bomb. We let that joke bomb. All right. Uh, so basically, we are not going to ever record together. I wanted to talk to about I wanted to talk about um, the channel, uh, my YouTube channel specifically. And I, if, you, if you've looked at it le lately, you've noticed that um, I've uploaded two videos as of late. And the both of them have been upload um edited by Pinecone, aka TV Tar, aka Jack. He's a good I friend know that guy. of the channel. And he's one of the one of the thirds of the Bagel Boys podcast. He's a great dude. And he offered to um edit some stuff for me. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay. And I sent him some footage and he edited it and he he spit out two really fucking good videos. Two really Let's funny videos. Go. And I, um, I really appreciate him doing that because otherwise I seriously don't think that I would have uploaded anything for a very long time. And I right. think that's going to con continue because I think at this point that I've, I've just simply lost the passion that I've had before for editing. I, I just don't have it anymore. Mm -hmm. I can, for, I can firmly say that I don't have the same passion that I did for editing um i like back in 2018 i just it's just gone man it's just not there anymore now let me ask i wonder if this has anything to do with like maybe you're just editing less often no i i that might have something to do with because it because i but... feel like if i go like a long time without doing something it's a lot harder for me to get back into doing it but it could be the vice versa sometimes, you know, maybe you edit it too much. You know, I know you got some Cosmics projects going on and maybe that just kind of ruined the mood for you. I could, I, I feel like it might be, started. that could be a factor. It might be because I haven't done it for a while, but it's also, right. um, it's also, you know, like the added, the added stress that I had in my life, like the job, you know, and yeah, Avery has a job now and, uh, basically, uh, he owes me a lot of money, so he got to pay me off. <laughs> Yes, of course. Um, how much do you want? How much money do I have left anyway? Couple grand. Fuck. Okay. Um, and yeah, so I have a job now, and I'm working like almost every night. Like legit, I only have like two days off a week. Okay, and no need like, to flex. Like the la last week, I think I worked like seven days straight, um, just nonstop, and shit, shit fucked me up. I can, cl I can definitely say that that shit fucked me up. Working, you know, I, like I'm. A, I don't want to sound like a little baby bitch, but like work is just tough, dude. Let me ask Working you, Ari. Um, what's up, man? I don't know if it's different in your state, but I think in California, we're not like if you're doing like if you're a part time job. I don't think you could work seven days in a row without like act like overtime or something. Because if you're working like seven days in a row, it's like considered uh, like full time or something, even if it's not forty hours. I could be wrong on that. I, it, I it's crazy that they gave you seven days in a row. I had to. I, you know. I had to. Um, I was doing a favor for a coworker, and I took. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. I took. I think that's one different. Than if, okay. And I think that's, it, that, that I so. I regret it. I on one hand I regret it like a fuck ton because simply because. Ouch. Yeah, I feel you. But on the other hand, I know my paycheck is going to be looking good like this Friday. I know it's going to be looking good. So yeah, you know. Yeah, I, I work a typical nine to five, you know, five days a week. And I just, I can't imagine working more than that. I just can't. You know, back when I did retail, obviously, it's, I hated like not knowing if I'd have a day off. Mm -hmm. And then I hate my manager going, like, hey, so like, do you want to work that day? And it's like, no. <laughs> it's a day like, off, I've, God damn it. I've never really understand, understood. 
like the people who could just say no like straight up no to their bosses because like that shit stresses me out like yeah it, it's hard i remember my la- literally my last like week at my grocery store job i had um i had to work basically the whole week but i was supposed to have saturday off but then i'd work that sunday but then that monday I'd be starting like a whole new job, completely different environment. Just like I was so stressed and like you know like freaked out about it. And then my and then my manager, she was like, "Hey, so like, do you want to work Saturday?" I'm like, "No." And then she basically like was like, "Come on, do it." I'm like, "Fine." I'm I was so mad, dude. You oh man, just I wanted to no. cry. I I own I should have, but I just couldn't. So I worked it. Um. Yeah, so that kind of sucks, but it it's happens, fine dude. now. Like bosses are scary, dude. Like they they have superiority over you, and if you're if you um if you're younger, that's then why we need sure. to unionize. We need to unionize. <laughs> dude, I was in we a need union. to unite the working class. Dude, the working class <laughs> needs to be united together dude. against the corporations. I hear like, stories of like people being like, "Oh, I, I can't go into work that day. I have a, I don't have a ride." And then their manager would call them an Uber, <laughs> so they have no excuse <laughs> for not to go. It's like, "Fuck, dude, I can't imagine not, being in that environment we, anymore." And then we have deducted the Uber costs from your salary. <laughs> <laughs> they take it from your salary. <laughs> That's actually fucked no. up. No. Oh man, dude, I hated retail. Like, dude. Keep up the good work, Gary. That shit sucks. Thanks, man. I'll, I'll try. But um, yeah, that that just basically is just me saying like that had that me having a job definitely had a part in killing my um passion for editing. And yeah. I wouldn't say my passion for editing is completely dead. It's just not as strong as it used to be. Um, twenty eighteen was mm. probably like one of the best years for my channel. Because that's when I was doing the the commenting on like everywhere, you know, and that that's got my subscribers up. And because of subscribe, my subscribers started going up. I felt like, man, I have to like make some videos. I have to pump out some good content. And I pumped out like what I'd say to be some of my greatest works um, so far. And they're just some really good videos that I pumped out during that time. And after, and I think at 2019. Um, I, I tried to like maintain it, but slowly and surely I just kind of stopped uploading and then 2020 and 2021, I could just, I just couldn't bounce back. I couldn't bounce back. And now I'm just here, you know, just kind of, would you say that if you had an editor, maybe you could get back on the, on the grind? Yeah, I, I think I would. I think I, I think. If I I think I definitely say that my passion for editing is gone, but not my passion for making like content. Content's fun, you know, like exactly. recording with friends, recording with friends, and um, like having fun, making uh, funny moments. I think that's a lot of fun, and you know, because what I remember when we, from our talks, every time basically you record, and then you just become so down that like the thought of oh my god, I have to edit. Yeah, it dawns was, on you, and then you're like, "Man, I don't, I can't do this." I, I like, and you postpone it, postpone it, and it happened to me too. And maybe you having an editor finally can reignite your passion for creating content, and you can just continue to pump out the videos once you have somebody on a paycheck. The I always like back, back, back a long time ago. I always was just so confused on how on how YouTubers were paying money to get like um editors and 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 um what the fuck is it called? And thumbnail artists. I just couldn't understand it. And then that's until I got an actual thumbnail artist. And like it just makes your it just makes your videos a lot more professional. Who and is your thumbnail artist? I have two. Um uh Artemis, shout them out. Artemis, uh, on Discord and on fucking Twitter. Uh, what's their actual ad though? I think it's something completely different. Hold on, just give me a minute, boys. While he's looking for that, I do want to shout out fucking Frost Drive. The guy's a G. He made the yes. animation for this podcast. I want to use him more often, dude. I love his work. I, do too. I don't think I don't think it's expensive. Like how good it is. And I refer Thaddeus to him, you know, anything to give him some business. So we love you. Uh, keep on Frost drive, staying frosty. Um, 
because I, I know he listens, yeah, fro- listens to the podcast. At Frost Drive okay. made us a new uh, album cover for No More White Woman 2020. We're crossing Dude. fingers. Our, our publisher finally not will decline. Let me actually check right now. I was going to do that, too. You don't have to if you don't want. I'll do it. No, I'm, I'm already there. I'm already there, too. I, I, so what the frick? I think we're I think we're balling. I think I don't have no... Yep, I think yeah. we're fine. Well, I think I think we're fine. I can confirm that we're fine. I definitely want to attach Frost Drive to the Cosmic Cast name. You know, the Cosmic's name because he's one of us. <laughs> the household name. He's definitely, he's definitely like a like. I think he's perfect for what our style is going for. He's a boy, know? man. He's a fellow boy. I definitely like to get him on for more stuff. Like, and we have. We have more ideas for more animations yeah. and shit. Oh, and dude, I have stuff a we want to do for our background. A lot of time. It's, we're, we're gonna, Frost. Okay, <laughs> let's uh, let's move on. Um. Okay. I don't think Ari, Ari did you ever shout out the, the other uh, one? Yeah. Uh, no, I did not. Uh, so um, their twit um Jesus Artemis on Twitter man. is at Arties A R T Y S underscore missives M I S S I V E S or just Artemis simply. Um, that's one of my artists. And Pacha Bell. Uh, what's her fucking at? So Is she still this, this. in business? Yeah, dude. Damn. She's still um she's still she's currently working on commissions right now. Let's go. Um Pacha Bell Art, P A C H E L B E L L E Art is um another one. I haven't I haven't um gotten anything done from her for a while, but she's still I still consider her one of my um Thumbnail artist, and she's great. And she's a fellow artist. Boy. Is great. Well, yeah. There you I'd, go. I'd say boys that. support boys. Yeah, and um, there are some. They're great artists, and I can definitely unlike once I got them, I could definitely tell why YouTubers get thumbnail artists. And as soon and I, I didn't understand why they would get editors as well until Pine um, Pinecone just like said, "Let me edit some stuff for you," and then it was. It really is as easy as sending them the footage telling them like what you want basically and they as long as an editor is good and pinecone is fucking good they can give you exactly what you want and maybe that's I, what you've been missing this whole time i think so i i i i think so maybe maybe until my true passion for um editing comes back which might take a while I don't know. <laughs> but now you if can it focus does on, ever come back. Now you can focus on money making, like streaming and m- yeah. producing videos and making co- podcasts and doing voice work. Now you don't that have to. smoking crack. You, now, now you, that, that's, is that racist? Uh, Excuse me? <laughs> what the fuck did you say to me? <laughs> um, and I I'm don't sorry. Know, I, it it kind of sounds, it kind of sounds like you were gaslighting me there, Jason. <laughs> okay. Oh my God. I'll oh, have um, you know I was confirmed the top sniper in the U.S. Armed Forces. I'm very good at shooting gas canisters. <laughs> yeah, so uh, anyways. <laughs> anyways, yeah. I've gaslighted over 300 politicians. Yo, Jack, my inbox is open. If you want to edit some videos for me, let me know. We'll talk. Randomly, Ryan, where are you at? Dude, randomly, Ryan won't come to Twitch. I tried. I tried to poach him the other day or a couple weeks ago. Well, help me out then, randomly, Ryan. I'm just no. No, random. You're not allowed no. to do that. We hate you. I mean, I mean, we love you. So come to me. Come back. That's Jacob's new thing. I, I have to shout out my Twitch, twitch.tv slash Cosmic Domino. Come check out some of my live streams. Okay, that is it. Oh, wait. You got the affiliate, though. Hold on. Let's talk about oh, that. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. It, it doesn't have to be a big topic, but yeah, dude. I got Twitch affiliate, baby. What exactly and is affiliate? He can get so subs it, now. It basically... Yeah, it means I can get subs. People, I, well, I can think people donate regardless. I get subs. I can have like Twitch emotes and shit. It's basically, it's basically like Partner Junior was like, here's, so, here's like, here's the key to the house. You have some responsibility. <laughs> here's the key not to the house. To be you, there can by only, yourself. you can only stay in the corridor. You cannot walk past the entrance. <laughs> you can take I off your just shoes. Like, <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> Dude, I was thinking like it's the key to the house, but you're not allowed to enter it unless someone's home. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. a, that's a, that's, a, that's a better analogy. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> hey, you want to be home alone? But well? dude, well, <laughs> I do have to say I did that in like a month. I had like one or two followers when I started streaming last month, and now I'm already like at fifty six. But followers, that's crazy. Let's go. Yeah, one it's month. crazy go. growth for me. Yeah, one month. 
And I do want to shout out people like Nier who donated. He donated 18 bucks to me. So Nier I Robots used it to, is a fucking G, I used it dude. I love to, that guy. Yeah, and I, I, I told you guys, I want to use some money for the stream, and I did. I used that money to buy, they wanted me to buy a really, really spicy hot sauce from the Hot Ones, and then I'm just going to put them on some wings and just, like, fucking make myself suffer this weekend once it gets here. You are a fool. You're an absolute it's fool. It's going to be awesome. Oh, my so God. I'm going to do it. I kind of want to do IRL streams now. I want to put the mask on. I just want to go crazy. I I, I, I want to move out. And then maybe I'll try to I'll try those. I want to move out because I can be let's acting start the fool. House. I can be acting a fool in my parents' house. That's upsetting, man. Yeah, so. no, no, no. It's crazy. What if they walk in on me just doing this, just just like half naked with a mask on? I can't handle. Will your parents beat you? Um. Anyways, uh, moving on. <laughs> <laughs> You Is okay, that a cry bro? You for help? Talk? Yeah. What happened? Stop <laughs> suggesting therapy for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh, Anyways, yeah, God. follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash cosmic domino. Thanks. What happened to Thaddeus in the server? I don't care. No, it's a pity. Oh, okay. oh, you oh, guys are the ones who brought yes, it up. Yes, 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 bro, yes, I was yes, 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 yes. He told yes, us we have to tell not this. to bring it up. Are you sure you want to? Yes, of course, this, of course. Okay, this is all but you Austin, tell it. Thaddeus. You, this is all Austin. I'm not telling it. What? No, you're telling it. <laughs> it's you that wants you to tell, tell it. You could tell it better. Oh. No, you wanted to tell it. You wanted to tell uh, it. Jake, Nigga, can you it's, fucking it's, say it? Stop fucking... Yeah, you tell it. Oh, no, no, you Jake, tell it. No, 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 fucking say it. Message. It's your message, so you gotta do it. Because Ari... Okay, I'll do it, but Austin told me to pin it, okay? It wasn't my idea. All right, sorry, Thaddeus. Uh, Kill you, yourself. You, he, fo he followed me on Twitch, though. Really? So Again? I don't know Again? If I do it anymore. Wait, all right. Jacob, all right. Just go, get, Hold get everything really quick. Hold everything really quick. Jacob, okay. last time we were recording Extra Reverb, Jacob admitted he'd been watching some old Leafy videos. He told Coker to kill himself three times unprovoked <laughs> while we were recording that. Now <laughs> Jason's is doing it. Unprovoked. Have the two of you been watching it was Leafy not videos together? Unprovoked. It was not unprovoked, you lying sack of <laughs> shit. Okay, the first time it was not, though. But anyways, all Coker right, continue. Coker is ridiculous. All right, fine. I'll kill it yourself. Out. Has <laughs> lost its punch. Shut up. Uh, <laughs> anyway. I think it truly has. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> what the no, fuck? I, I gotta agree. Has. Now shut All up. All right, I'm gonna go tell Biden. Just kidding. <laughs> tell Biden. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry. What? It's not gonna what understand you. you? To me? <laughs> well, fellow Americans, uh, <laughs> what the deal is is that if we and then uh, the point is is I am kill the killing yourself is the the idea behind. Thank you for your attention. <laughs> I, I I promise to ban fracking. But now, and but now the RuPaul's Ranch in Wyoming has brought us so much money that you yeah, actually I, I live not too far from RuPaul's uh, fracking ranch in Wyoming. That's pretty funny, I think. All right. Well, oh my God, should I go to Kanye's ranch in Wyoming for a video? Like, how illegal is that? I mean, he's gonna come out and. Uh... Tell you who was in Paris, and then he's gonna kill Just you. Just don't enter his property. <laughs> Good morning, Kanye. <laughs> yeah. Shut the fuck hand up. Of, <laughs> hand of the daily newspaper. It's like I'm not subscribed to the newspaper. It, it's it's a uh, it's fuck. <laughs> what the fuck reads the newspaper? Anyways, Jacob, tell the story. So, Austin, and, uh, this is like a week or two ago. Austin and I were live streaming, which is rare, I know, because Austin. <gasps> About a week ago. <laughs> Anyways, Austin and I were live streaming together. Uh, we were live streaming Stardew Valley. You know, the usual. I'm live streaming all the fucking time. And then we see some commotion going down in the in the Discord. You know, people are messaging like, yo, check out what Thaddeus is doing on Discord. And I'm like, what the fuck? And, and so Austin and I were like, all right. So I, I open up Discord. And everyone's like, dude, Thaddeus, what, what, what? Um, so Thaddeus was playing a game. Uh, do you remember what it's called, Austin? Because I don't. It was, it was Sexual Void. The game was called <laughs> Sexual Void. It's a hentai and I'm like, game. <laughs> it's a hentai game. So I'm like, what's getting fuck clown for it? No. So bad. Oh, and, and, then he, and then he started trying to deny it, too. <laughs> <laughs> you never try to do that. You can't be caught in 8K and try to deny it. 8K. <laughs> 8K. No, wait, no, no. Discord, at this, holy no, hold fucking up, hold up. shit. At this point, it's 4K, okay? <laughs> 
But it was about to become AK, all right? right <laughs> okay, right. Right. Okay, 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 you got the screenshot of him playing the game in Discord, okay? Yeah. So I, I, I also want to preface preface this by saying like 90% of our uh, Discord user base is 14-year-olds, so it makes it funnier. Uh, they, they were sending screenshots of Thaddeus playing a game called Sexual Void, and he kept deleting it. And I'm like, what the fuck is sexual void? So I look <laughs> it up on I look it up on Steam. He tried to delete and, the screen. <laughs> I try to look it up on Steam. It doesn't even show up. I'm like, what the fuck? So I go on Google Chrome. I look up sexual void. I'm like, oh, here it is. I click into it. And I just see giant tits running around as like the fucking Steam advertising. I am video. searching this me, fucking up right now. And I'm like, hold on, hold on. let what me look the, this up. I'm like, what the fuck? So basically, Th uh, Austin and I call it Thaddeus. We're like, dude. What the fuck are you doing? I I guess he meant to go offline or something when he played it. He just didn't think that it would show up. I don't know. Sexual and then Thaddeus void? was like, I did yep, not play this it. game. You have no proof of me playing this. So I go back on the Steam <laughs> yeah, website. No it shows friends who own this game. <laughs> it shows Thaddeus' <laughs> icon. So, <laughs> uh, but it had like a different fancy name. So I screenshotted that, put that in the Discord. So he goes on Steam and changes his nicknames. <laughs> oh, no, that's not me. My nickname <laughs> is Thaddeus James. Despite it being this the same avatar so picture. So I go back on the <laughs> Steam website. I, I press refresh and it just changed the name. So I'm like, well, here's more proof. And everyone basically no. bullied the shit out of him. <laughs> oh my God. He was trying Because he was so caught in 4K. Hard. He was, he was caught, caught in, 4K, in 16 and then he got fucking caught in 4K. 4K again. Now it's 8K. Dude, this is barely even a game. This isn't a game. It's just. Oh, nigga. Dude, this no. is inter interactive porn. <laughs> It's just interactive porn. It's literally all it is. It, it, it's interactive porn. There's no story. It's just like click this and like they do ah. something and like you, okay, you okay, off, okay, you hold jerk on. off with hold it on, and like hold you on, earn hold points. On. I guess. Let's, I don't let know. me say something right now. You can't. No. I can. I will never. I will never ever clown on a nigga for playing a porn game. There's nothing wrong. I play porn games. I will. I'm gonna be honest with you. Listen, listen, Jacob. Shut the fuck up. Listen. You, can, you don't have to clown. You can. You can no, not clown. Listen, you on cannot a, uh, clown on a nigga for just being horny. All right. You can't do that. But you can. That's clown fine. When they get caught. caught, if a nigga's down bad, if a nigga's down bad, you can't clown on that. But if you but try to lie about it, <laughs> if you try to hide, if you try to deny, that's when you clown on them. That's why you clown. Thaddeus, you a clown. You got caught. It's too late, bro. It's too late. Are we're we coming sure for you. Are we sure we want to like keep this bit like this? No, this we're keeping in this. He's we're keeping this pissed. in. We're keeping this in. I didn't want to tell the story. It, it was everyone else. He's already Listen, over Daddy's. it. Listen, Daddy is. I'm probably gonna play this. I'm probably gonna play this. I'm not gonna lie. I can play this. Only three dollars, bro. I might play this. How much? I might Only play three? this. Hold on. Only three dollars, dude. Hey Siri, open Steam. And as and as long as you don't play it for more than like three hours, then you can return it. Do you want to censor his name? No. Who? Thaddeus? Yeah. Come on. Everybody already already in 8K. Already in 8K. Jacob, we don't have such a big reach. Everybody in the server already this. knows who it is. Everyone in the All server right. already knows who it is. I'm remember? sorry, Thaddeus. I, I really tried. It's okay. I we'll, really we'll, tried. We'll, we'll simply promote his mixtape when it comes out. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> As an apology. <laughs> Sorry we clowned on you, dog. Here's a plug for you. <laughs> what do you mean? Come on, man. What's wrong with promoting his music? No, no, you're not it's wrong. Not it's not that it's wrong. It's, it's nothing wrong with it. It's just the it's just that's how we make it better. Like, hey, <laughs> sorry. Hey, dog. Hey, look, sorry, we got, sorry we had to let you sorry we had to let you go. Uh sorry we didn't give you a severance package. But we will yeah. promote your mixer. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> uh, first of all, it's his fault for getting caught playing hands high. Like, hold on a second. <laughs> it is his fault for that. Like, it is kind of public knowledge if you think about it. Oh my god, that is hilarious. That is Down fucking hilarious. horrendous. And also, it's 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 what he gets for taking a joking argument we had on Twitter and literally like he like posted something that in theory would have like genuinely canceled me, but uh. Oh, fuck no. you, no proof. This uh, again. So fuck you, Thaddeus. We hate you. Okay, I want to talk about this. Fuck the Thaddeus talk. I, Jacob, 
We're on episode, okay, on an nope, episode. Okay, no, it's cutting no, out. It's getting cut no, out. No, it's not. It's not. Shut right, up. Yes, it is. Jacob, I'm cutting this out. You're not cutting this out. <laughs> I'm cutting no, this out. No, we need to talk about this. Shut up. We need to talk about this. No. We need to talk about this. Man, Jacob, on, do stop. Do stop. I'm literally cutting Jacob, this out. Jacob, we There's need no to point. talk about this. No, Jacob, I'm not. Stop. No. Stop. If you're cutting it out, then why are you stopping him from talking? Just let him talk. Okay, he can talk if he wants, but it's getting cut out. Let's let let hear Ari out, and then you cut. You can cut out the whole segment if you don't like it. Okay. Okay. Hi, guys. We're back. We talked about something a little too serious um, about Mr. Girl molesting me. So we're oh cutting that out of the podcast <laughs> because he to, thought I was yeah, a kid. Come out with a lot of One episode, Jacob. <laughs> One episode. Oh, yeah. <laughs> God damn. I, I, I didn't say we it. So I didn't close. say it. I didn't say it. I didn't say it. But he didn't say grooming. Oh, my God. Grooming, 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 grooming. Why the police hate groomers? Groomer, 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 groomer. They hate us because we get our girls sooner. Oh, God. Oh, wow. God. I don't <laughs> of like the that. dome, Austin. <laughs> of the dome. Dude, Mr. Girl's going to message us, be like, I hate that you're putting words in my mouth. Yeah, I can put something in your mouth. <laughs> I should have just replied with that. It was right there. I should have just hit him with a, I got something you can put in your mouth. So that's <laughs> like, the know? second thing like we came up with after the fact that we really uh, wish we said. After my, I, uh, really... I want to do that Chris Hansen bit. That would have been so funny, God damn it. God, so, wait, I, did I ever say I that on the not, podcast? I'm not going to lie to you boys. I have not been having a good time during this episode. Simply because, I'm, I'm literally about to tell you. Simply because my, the headphone thing. Like, I can only oh. hear you guys out of one ear and it's like, it's about to give me a fucking headache at this point. Just switch ears. Flip the headphones. Uh, yeah, it's time that it's ears. time for you to get new headphones, man. Oh, that's even like, worse. Holy shit. That's awful. No. Oh my god. That felt right. immediately bad Dude after all this right. episode you, you, if you can you need to buy new headphones like now yeah. Yeah, No, it's no, not it's that not it's his extension it's cable it's the extension cable. Oh yeah. well Okay, um So what like what's the fix for next time? Are you just not gonna use it next time? Uh Fucking no, dude. We'll okay, buy a new we'll extension then. Buy a new extension cable. That's like probably like three bucks on Amazon. I'll buy it for you. What do you need? Send me a link of what you need. Dude, I just any extension cable. I don't really care. <laughs> Amazon like looks, extension, no, buy a like good one. USB buy a good one cable? so we don't have these problems as as anymore. It's not like a foot or like three feet. Just something long. I might have an extra one just sitting around. I'll try it. I'll maybe. I'll look for it. All right. So, we can, well, we can talk about Leafy. Uh yes. Uh so Leafy, we talked about there was him. a time we were talking Dude, about I know him you guys missed him. Uh we didn't. I don't. I hate him. Uh but long story short, uh, Leafy got accused of grooming. Thoughts? Uh it's, we couldn't it's have avoided much... grooming it either way. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's true. We had a grooming topic. Once again, it was, it was predestined. I really hate that this is like every ep- it's one thing of like, oh, we bring it up as a bit, but like it's not. Like it's a topic for every episode. Yeah. But this one no. has kind of a happy ending, sort of. Groomer is 60, I mean, <laughs> Groomer 69. No, episode 69, we have to either make it overly sexual or we can't make a single sexual joke. I just thought about it. <laughs> what would be funnier? I think it would be funnier if there, if we do just like a Christian version. No swearing, I, no horniness, and never acknowledge that it's a sick episode. I, I, I feel think like we that gotta be like, there. I right, feel like Gustavo, we have at the very least music, like, all right, here, welcome to episode 69. Nice. How's your guys' day? You know what I mean? You gotta no. say nice. No. You gotta. You, all right, I'll put it in the, the tags. Funny part. In the tags, that, just put the word nice. You have to. Yes. That, that's still gonna be the first Because it'll be tag. hidden. It'll be hidden. We gotta do more meta episodes. I'm, I've, I've been telling you. We gotta do so, more meta episodes. Anyways, continue. Do, Leafy. Do an episode without me. That'll be meta. Okay, so <laughs> Leafy is here, has been accused of grooming. It's by a girl on TikTok. Um, do you even remember her name? Uh, I can look it up for you. No, oh, I got she's, it. It's Kit she's is, not is, living Kit in my mind rent free. I got it right it's, here. Hang on. Kit her is, name is done. Is, it's Kit a is sentence. Done. It's a sentence just like Leafy is here. Kit is done. <laughs> it is. So listen, Um, first off, the, like as an allegation video, J- uh, Jason, wait, have you wait, wait, it's wait, fucking wait, wait, garbage. Wait, wait. Is, do you guys know that girl, Candice? She always came out. She also came out with that allegation. You know, Candice? I'm not fucking following, falling for that, you idiot. What? Falling for what? No, no. It's, it's, her name Who's is Candace. Candace. She also came. Can this dick fit in your mouth? Oh my god! No! Jacob, are you fucking serious? <laughs> no, no, we're really, at the bit. Really? 
Dude, every time someone says, uh, like, oh, something, something, Joe, I always do it on purpose. It's fucking funny. <laughs> no, don't give him that pleasure. You need to make him feel like an idiot. I love pleasuring Jason. Oh. <laughs> oh <laughs> this just got super sus. <laughs> yeah. Okay, dude, right. please continue <laughs> there. Why are you singing the fucking Fortnite song? You should be singing the Among it's Us. A, big, well, because I'm doing, I'm doing like the default dance. Among time. Us? <laughs> Who's the imposter? <laughs> I think that's the end of this podcast episode. <laughs> See you guys. Got, he peeked so funny because he laughed and then it just, he, he just hear it. It was like this. And he peeked from me so funny. It was just, ah! And then it just cut off. <laughs> it's really funny because Jason beats his wife. Whoa, whoa. Okay. whoa, whoa. That's right. That's whoa, why I'm bringing whoa. up the allegations. I have all the proof I need. <laughs> well, here's the proof. My goddamn mouth. My words. Okay? Because that's how it works nowadays. You just say what happened, and it's true. Okay? Because that's you what happened with Leafy. Proof. Boom. Back on track, baby. Let's Boom. go. Okay. I did so, it. Jason, have you ever here. actually watched the um, allegation video? Nope. Yeah, I mean, it's you like five enough? seconds, okay. and it's fucking stupid. <laughs> yeah. If it's you actually cringe. watch the video, it's it's very cringe. Like I, yeah. I hate to say that word, but it's like there's nothing else to say about it. It's very cringe the way that she frames this because this is like a very serious allegation that she's painting. But oh. the way she's oh. delivering oh. the message really <laughs> makes my blood <laughs> boil. Okay, What's up? we should we should show the video on the podcast. But since the song's probably copyrighted, let's use a, I think it's a Kevin Mockleyod song because like. Dee, dee, you know what? You know you know what song I'm talking about? I think so. I think so. <laughs> It'll be funny. It'll be funny. The guys will get it. The boys will get it. I'm down to. I'm down to. <laughs> All right. So I'm I'm gonna read out specifically what it's what this whole thing is. Okay. Why somebody does the soundtrack? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Exactly. So she's basically like um singing it. She's saying it in the point of view of like how it happened. Basically. So she's saying. Uh, downloading an app called Amino and joining a group about Nekos when I was 13. Mm -hmm. Meeting a boy named Calvin and voice chatting with him and a few others. Talking to him every day, him calling me his baby, Skyping with him and watching him play games. Baby, baby. Happy I made a friend I could oh. talk to. Him promising me we can meet up when we're old enough. Calvin starts asking for nudes. Videos of me masturbating sends me pictures of himself hard at the thought of me. Please, Finding thank a you. Very Love you. Popular YouTube channel, and the YouTuber sounds like Calvin. Asking him about it, and suddenly he blocks me on everything, kicking me out of the group of friends we made. Finds out I had been groomed by a famous YouTuber and mourning the fact that he was like my abuser. Okay, so, and and she makes um she made several other um videos. Um, afterwards, basically going more in depth about these points, about um, what she said. And so she basically, <laughs> hold on. The second video is so fucking funny to me. Oh my God. Can we actually, actually watch this? Because there's like one point in it that I, f I fucking die at every single time. So please everyone click this link that I just sent into the chat and watch it with me for a second. So I'm just going to get into the meat of it. This comment right here, they're correct. It was Leafy is here. For those of you asking for proof, I was 13. I don't have that old phone anymore. I don't have that login information anymore. That happened and I completely got off of everything that was attached to him because I was hurt. I had lost a friend or who I thought was a friend. So I was hurt. I didn't know it was him, and when I found out, I was very confused. Because when I met Calvin, he used a picture of a little African American boy. <laughs> Is that the African American boy? So when I found boy? out, yes! That Calvin was <laughs> Yes! Let's go! I realized, okay, okay, this video. is not good. This is something's wrong here. I guess I'll make a part two. That is that is kind of funny because that's, that's kind of in character for Leafy. That's, yeah, that's something exactly Leafy would... in character for Leafy. <laughs> and in, in, in these videos that she explains, it's basically she says that while she was 13, she was on Amino and um, she got into contact with Calvin, a.k.a. Um, Leafy is here. And... 
she basically says that um he i think she said he was pretending to be 14 when he was actually 18 um that's what she said right and um i think if you go back and search up when this time frame would line up she said 2013 um wait was it 2013 she said it happened or was it oh my god i'm getting that's when he turned 18 so yes when she said she was 13 and um calvin was pretending to be 14 but was actually 18 18. exactly so that's the basic time frame and if you go back how old is um leafy is here right now he's 25 right 25 and if you go back right you know exactly how old he is (laughs) Don't pretend like you don't know. <laughs> yeah, he's 25. He's 25. And if you go back, uh, 25 minus la la la, and you get his, go ahead, say it, someone. He would have been wanna... 18 in 2013. 2013. He got his Yeti and... as a birthday present. That I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, that was good. I, I believed him. <laughs> <laughs> of course you did. Hold on. Okay. Wait, let me let me first confirm this piece of information I'm about to say that basically kind of debunks this whole thing. Um, ba-na-na. yep. Okay, so she alleges that this happened. Um, like in this time frame, it would have to be in 2013, right? Right? Am I right so far? Yes. Amina wasn't a fucking thing until 2014. Nice. So Posted. the time frame doesn't match up. This literally could not have. Ha- have happened in this time frame. Come on, man. Does she ever like go back and was like, oh, actually, you know what? I fucked up the date. No, no, never. She's been adamant about the story. And you can't even fucking ask that shit. Why? Because she turned off all her comments. She's turned off her DMs. She's turned off everything. <laughs> and she and before she even turned off the comments, she was blocking people when they asked about it. And she's blocking people on Twitter right now about it. That's how you know they're telling the truth. <laughs> when they're, when Man, they're shielding all this, themselves. I, all this is just takes away attention from the real thing. Exactly. From the real issues. Man, exactly. It makes me so upset every time. Dude, Calvin joked about it too on fucking uh, on Twitter. I did. He, he just because did he not know take it seriously because he knows be he like, didn't do it. Well, how can we believe the actual victim if this thing happens all the time? Shut the fuck up. It's, Wait, it's did you so just come, annoying? Hold on, did you just contradict yourself? No. Okay. Explain. Explain what you mean. Actual, no, explain what you mean. Because when the actual thing happens, when somebody gets groomed, motherfuckers will come in, in the victims' DMs like, "Well, well, you know, when it, it happened to Calvin, it turned out to be fake, so you're probably lying as well." And the more there are examples of people actually fabricating stuff for clout. Okay. The worse it is for the actual victims. Thank you for clearing that up. That makes much more sense. All right, now hear me out. Here's here's my thoughts, boys. We we do need to we do need to I say that we need to wait. I feel like we always need to wait until both sides come out and say what the fuck they they they, you know? Because if we don't have all the information and and we fucking do a horrible thing like uh can't like canceling somebody over something that eventually we find out they didn't even do you know and people can just put out these statements and instantly have like a, like 100 people believing them you know when when we always if they attach a big name to it if they attach a yeah. big name to it there's going to be 100 people um believing them like a, a minimum minimum 100 people if yeah, the story he, holds... What's up? Go ahead. I was just going to say, yeah, you, you just can't take things seriously until you know the truth. Hey, guys. Beatrice Jacob here. I just wanted to clarify real quick. I meant not as seriously as having the cold, hard facts. I wasn't saying don't take it seriously at all until you have at least a piece of information. And I think that could be where this part of what's going to happen might get misconstrued. And it might be some arguments because there may have been a misunderstanding. I'm not sure if that's the reason what caused this. And I do clarify as we go into this point. But I wanna I wanna take a chance to let you guys know before like, wait, what the fuck did you just say? What I meant to say was don't you know, you can't just go full blown like, oh shit, fuck this guy unless you a hundred like you have at least some form of information. Alright, continue. If I see too many often too many times where 
an actor or, you know, obviously a YouTuber get accused of something and everyone instantly be like, oh, that person's a piece of shit. And it's like, well, you don't know yet. Mm-hmm. So don't let his, but, don't but let his career get mindset. ruined off an accusation. I just, we I just, are talking about ahead. the entertainment industry, but when it comes to real life, like real people, we yeah. choose to believe the victim. I mean, yes. innocent exactly. before Thank you. proven oh my guilty. God. Yes, but when an actual person comes up to you and shares their story about... Like a friend that you know, like don't fucking that tell your friend. Oh, don't fucking. That. Where's the, where's the other side? Like, come on, come on. Like, we have to okay, wait for his side. No, Nick, no, don't do that. Yeah, don't be an asshole don't about it, but do don't that. like don't write something off until you know the truth. Like, oh, yep, Jacob, he's, he's no, a piece of shit. <laughs> oh my god, you need to fucking like actually like you know listen, like actually right. fucking. You need to treat that shit like it's serious. You know, it's just. I don't know, dude. We're, we're, no, we're I get you. Like, I get you. I feel like we base in, a lot of things. In our context, we're, we're talking about only entertainment industry. All I'm saying is don't, like, let it, um, you know, ruin, like, Leafy's image 100% because we don't know for sure whether or not it's true. <laughs> oh, my God. Don't take Leaf as an example, at least. Oh, no. <laughs> Come on, man. Okay. I why get what he's why, saying. Why are you I get, laughing I get what he's at me? saying. No, let, let, let me ask you this. Why are you laughing at me for saying that? Like I'm dead serious. Oh, how oh possibly? Like how is that disagreeable? Be is it because it's leafy, or is it because yes, you just like you exactly don't agree with my point? It's leafy. Okay, well, it is a I good mean, point, no, but I'm just, I, I'm just he, what he's I'm saying is he doesn't. It's leafy. Okay, no, he's saying that basically. I like what I feel is basically he's saying like leafy kind projecting? of already ruined his own image. No, I'm not projecting. I'm just like I feel like I don't want to be. I don't want to be ridiculed for having my point across because I I I 100 believe. Until you have 100% of the facts, you can't just write someone off and have their career be ruined because one person said something. Now, that's yeah. what happened with Tobuscus, right? Unless I'm remembering incorrectly. And, like, I'm just going to say that you're, into, you're coming very you close. To... You're, like, you got to, um, you're How? coming very Go close on. to, like, Go on, say doing, it. making a point. Of not believing the victims. You're coming very close I'm not to saying that. that. I'm <laughs> saying don't take it as fact until you know better. I'm not saying don't believe the victims. When did I say that? You're putting words in my mouth that never came out. Yeah, I'm, a girl, you motherfucker. <laughs> he I'm being 100% serious. This is not a bit. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was just... This that is, reminded me this of is a it, little situation. This, those two things mean exactly the same thing. You're saying... You, how, no, they don't. How are those different? How are those different? Explain then how they're different. I specifically said, look, I 100% agree. Hear the victim out and, you know, look into the case once you hear that. Okay, but don't say, okay. wow, this one person said that? Okay, fuck this guy. He's a piece of shit. I'm not going to I'm not gonna buy his merch. I'm not, I'm not going to do this. I'm not going to do that. Well, then, you know, okay, what if the accusations talking, are false? What if they're I'm, false? Because I'm talking, I'm talking to you about the real life. Uh-huh. Because. Okay. Okay. Real life, when, when there's not, it's not, it's not public figures involved. Okay. Are you talking only about the public figures right now, or in general? I'm talking about everybody? public figures right now. I'm talking about public okay, figures. Okay, then, right now. then, then, fucking but say I still, it. I still agree a... in general. I did though. I did. Is the thing. I fucking did. But okay. <laughs> right. You can listen to the podcast back. You can listen to it back. You hear specifically <laughs> what I said. Man, all we right. all know he wishes Leafy was guilty. That's why he went off. He I hates. Le I, keep in mind, Jason I hate Leafy. I don't wish he was guilty. I don't wish nobody to be groomed. I'm just saying that D Jacob being, well, Leafy's image could be a ruin. Man, it, this is Leafy. I, I don't I think said, Leafy cares. I said, look, don't, okay. It, see, right, this is enough, a complicated enough. problem because it's Leafy. Me, Jason on, hates Leafy interrupt. alongside to a lot of other people. I hate Leafy. But let's say it's anyone else Leafy. in this case. Let's say it's anyone else in this case. I'm okay, just saying. I agree. You, I agree. You, can't, you can't just let someone be completely you know, brought down because of an accusation. Because like, what if it isn't true? And in this case, we don't believe it's true. It might not, it might be we don't know, but we're it sounds like we're we're on the scale towards we don't necessarily believe it at least not right. yet. But what I'm gonna say is that now that's my opinion, but I'm gonna for I'm gonna ridic even I'll go down as I'll go as far as ridiculing myself when it comes to a public figure, and I'll believe the victim for the sake of believing the victim. That's prejudice. No matter who it is, no matter when that happens. Because the worst case scenario, I will look like a fool believing the victim who got believing somebody I'm not who saying told bullying the victim. who told. I'm not. I'm not saying that either. I'm saying that I'm gonna go look go down as a fool as somebody who believed the victim instead of saying like, well, hold on, let's hear out the rapist first. 
<laughs> that's what. That's all I'm gonna say. I mean, honestly, I would just say at that point, don't even say. I just want to say anything. I want to say, oh, I don't believe this person yet, or I, I just want to say anything. I won't ha- just don't have thoughts on it until you know for sure. All right. Because it, I mean, if you think of, because doing that, I know this is kind of complicated. Um, it's kind of the opposite of how like at least the American court system works. You can't just be like, oh, well, the victim said this, so yep, yep, they're I mean, fucked. Yeah, it's literally because no, you gotta hear out the defense. System, the little, the literal fucking law. I don't know if it's a literal law, but like it's innocent before before proven it's guilty. innocence until proven guilty. Until yes, proven guilty. it's, it's exactly. an American. I don't know if it's a law or like part of the Constitution, but that is a fact, and that is like the point of the whole just justice system so to so to speak innocent the, until proven the, guilty the not guilty deals, until proven the innocent internet deals into guilty until proven innocent that's literally how the internet works yes it's the exactly the and that's the point i try to make earlier all right but you still can't deny this the the way society is shaped now you can bring in the law and the facts as much as you can but i feel like we should still focus especially on supporting the victim right now in order to Break the stigma of like never believing the victim. I mean, yeah, you could side with the victim. I'm just saying, I I don't know, just like don't write off the uh, not the accuser, the accused. When it's you a know, don't go figure. on Twitter and be like, yeah, Leafy's a piece of shit. I fucking hate him. I hope he dies. I hope he goes to jail because you don't know if he actually did it. But you can be like, oh man, I feel sorry for you. I hope this isn't true. Wait, only or, when or it's not a not that figure. not that. Don't tell the don't tell the fucking victim like, oh, I hope this isn't true. So, but you know, you know what I mean. Let me say this really quick. If you accuse somebody and they're not actually guilty, like if you accuse somebody and they didn't actually do anything, then th- that person getting canceled, that makes them the victim. Exactly. Yes. You're just flipping the narrative at this point. But that's Pretty much, a fair point. Yeah. I, I agree about the public figure. But I feel, I definitely but, feel like it's a I different like, case in real life. Think about, it, think about it like this. What if it was you? But also, what if you were being accused of this thing? But, but I'd I'm never do say, it. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. That's I it. Knew he'd say that. If you are innocent, all you gotta say is I didn't do it. You okay. can debunk the proof. And <laughs> okay. we saw and in, in okay. the case of Leafy. Okay. But how, you how, see how, how would you feel? It got it's, how you would see you how feel? fast it got debunked in the case of Leafy? Okay. Hold on, let me finish. You okay. see how fast it got debunked in the case of Leafy? You see how fast it got debunked in the in the case of Pyro. Sure. Just say you didn't do it. If you have nothing to hide and if you if you are innocent, then simply you can just simply prove it. Okay. That is well, all. I'm just saying, though, how would you feel if 99% of people were, like, attacking you, were against you because they believed the accuser when it didn't happen? You wouldn't like that very much, I figure, because I wouldn't. I know, I'm sure the rest of you would So wouldn't. you're projecting, after all. How am I pro- No. I'm just saying. Think about have it in guys, that perspective. Hold on. Um, have you guys heard of a, of, of, of a person by the name of Solid Shibe? Yes. No. Austin, did you hear that he came back recently? I don't know him that well, but like, what happened? So, he's been um he was uh I don't know if he was really in the fucking um commentary community, but he was a pretty well known name a little a, a while back a while back yeah, and he went away because um I've actually found out about this like a little while ago, so my memory of it is very rusty, but um he went away because he was accused um by his uh girl ex-girlfriend or girlfriend at the time can't remember exactly of rape he was accused of rape and um he went away for he went away after apologizing and all that and he came back with a video basically of him basically telling what actually happened and so you tweeted about that i see what you're talking about now what you tweeted tweeted about that i think so did i or I don't think I maybe did. I'm confused. I might have been talking about whatever. something else. Go on, go on, go on. Um, and oh, okay, yeah, no, I did not tweet about that. That was something completely different. Um, right, and he came out with a video, uh, basically telling what actually happened, and basically he was he was literally gaslit by his girlfriend into believing that he had raped that he had raped her because he was drunk because he was drunk. And he and he his girlfriend basically gaslit him. His girlfriend and his friend group at the time basically gaslit him into believing that he had raped her when that's not what happened. Okay. And your point? And I'm 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 getting to it, buddy. <laughs> He's still talking. Um and 
and basically it's just like he was he was basically like forced off the internet by people and believing that he was a rapist simply because he was like he he thought he was too and when he actually had like literal fucking not evidence but like his father who was like there who was who was there like in the house while it was all going down and he knew that they, they never happened and he basically had to when he knew about it and he actually came back and he had he made a whole video about it discussing it better than i'm discussing it but he came back and basically ex explained that he didn't do it i i know i'm not explaining this well but what i'm basically trying to say is that like he was he was he was everyone was against him it's he hard. was you even against himself. I know what you're trying to say. You want you want to say that it's sometimes it's even hard for yourself to prove the innocence, but this is such a nuanced case. Perhaps, don't you think? Hold on, what are we discussing here? Leafy. I, I feel like I've lost track. I feel like I've lost track. Leafy. Well, it started no, with Leafy. No, it's, obviously, it's far past Leafy at this point. What are you? What are you, Jason, and you, Jacob, arguing about here? We're talking about believing the victim, even in the in the public figure context. Jacob was getting was up in arms of me because because I I was like because in the Leafy's case, I thought that his image was not um, you know it's okay that his image got hurt by it, or like that. I'm actually saying, my argument was. Leafy's I'm saying that's prejudice. I'm saying that's prejudice. Yes. And that's my argument. Okay, then let's move on from it. I got one last thing to say though. Okay. Funny right. enough. Pedophilia is one is the one thing that I've ever seen Leafy take a hardline stance on since he came back, because he was on his stream like multiple times talking about how that sticks with you. Do you ever get caught like actually being a pedophile? That's on your permanent record of your life, like for the rest of your life. He was talking about that because he was talking about like Basher and what happened with with him. Anyway, Good whatever. Leafy. I say in in I say in real life and my final thoughts on this in real life I feel like it's 100% different than public figures um in real life like if a friend comes to you and basically confides in you and say that they were raped I definitely think it's a whole different situation than a someone Yeah, online. I'll always believe like a friend because why would they lie to me? You know, over like some random person on the internet. That's not just some stranger online maybe sort of a you know, uh, chasing clout. Mm -hmm. You need to realize, like, in real life, you're someone, you're inside. You're, like, on the inside of it. While in, in on public figures, you're on the outside looking in yeah. on a situation. So there's definitely different rules to it, you know? And I think that's what you both need to realize. That's something you both need to realize. Okay. Enough of that. Okay. Amari just sent me a message saying... Ari is a dummy who chews on bottle caps. That's yes. probably bad for you. I do and that's that. why we hear the chewing noises when he's yes. streaming. Are you yes. serious, man? Just chew on your thumb like a real man. No, okay. that hurts. You know, I gotta chewing say, Chewing on a bottle cap is a feminine trait. I haven't done research on this, <laughs> but I want to be surprised if there's, like, risk of cancer. I'd be careful, dude, Shut buddy. The fuck up! I'm serious. Don't be a fucking, don't be a fucking mom on Facebook. <laughs> like, okay, I won't. I'm I'm just being sure like, for you, buddy. Um, you cannot uh, do that because chewing on the bottle caps can give you cancer. You can't do this. Like, don't Plus, give me that. Shit. Actually, there's an argument to be made that drinking water bottles in general could be a, a cancer. Risk oh my god! Shut up! Shut up! Okay, shut I'll, I'll stop. I'll stop. But it's true. It's, it's true. true. Let's do the good old four questions that we all like. I want to do. What does Cosmic Cast plan on doing when the COVID is over? Meeting up, LA. I'm so, that's the I'm sorry first I care plan. For you, Ari. I'm sorry, man. No, you you I two did. need to fucking apologize to each other for fucking. The fuck am I going to apologize for? Other. No, no, yelling apologize apologize at each other for? and being fucking rude. Y'all need to apologize to each other. That shit was not okay. I mean, I, st I still want to, like, kiss him. Like, nothing's changed <laughs> yeah. there. Yeah. I just, it was an argument right. or no, a debate I'm, I'm that not, sounded like an argument. This wasn't a fucking bit. I'm being serious. You guys were very rude to each other, and it's like... It actually... was just a heated debate. It's all it is. Like, I'm not mad at Jason or anything. I just... Oh, shit. I had to get my point across, and, I, you know, obviously, I'm sure he felt the same way. That's all it was, man. That's all it is, boys. Yeah, there you go. absolutely. There you when go. I say boys, I mean girls too. We're all boys here. There you right. go. Now kiss and make up. Ah.
So yeah, the question was, what does the Cosmic Cast plan on doing when the COVID is over? Uh, yeah, I'm um with each other or like on our separate lives. No, with each other, the Cosmic this Cast as all together. Oh yeah, then yeah, we definitely plan on meeting up. 100%. Probably LA. We take in Jacob Thaddeus. We're going out. We're having fun. Okay, five way. We're making videos. Thaddeus will be there. Hey, dude. Yeah, we're gonna we're, we're gonna fun. pump out a lot. We're gonna try to pump out a lot of content. Yeah, we're gonna make a month worth of content in a week, and you know, fuck yeah, dude. It's gonna be great. Okay, I just muted Jason. Everybody, I hate him. I fucking hate him. <laughs> like he could just die for all I care. Yeah, thank you for watching. Oh fuck! <laughs> I, oh fuck! I thought he was muted. Oh no! <laughs> really. He's gonna come back in. Don't yeah, worry. he's gonna come back, and we're gonna talk about JoJo Siwa and the baby. Oh when he comes God, back that, crying, is that one of the questions? Yeah. Oh, thank God. It's from Thaddeus. Oh, I gotta choose my favorite question. Hmm. I gotta say, I do. I do have to say, I I'm not mad at Jason, but this is the one time where it's like I was trying to have a serious like, you know, I was trying to say my point across seriously, and he was kind of like laughing at me for it. And that's kind of why, like, I got serious there. That's all. You know what I mean? Because, okay. like, I don't want to be belittled for this. I don't want to be belittled for this because this was, like, a serious, like, topic I was trying to bring up. He was like, <laughs> you, you, that's your opinion? Oh, your opinion is bad. And it's like, okay, yeah. well, let me explain why He's it's He's blinded not. by his feelings about Leafy. But it, it, that's the problem. That was the problem there, too, I think. It's just that it was kind of prejudiced because we were talking about Leafy specifically, and he does yeah. not like Leafy out of all of us. <laughs> he, I think he hates him. So, but we're, I'm not mad at him. We're good. We're good. You guys, you guys know. You're, you're, you're all boys here. And when the comments, jeez, those sound like we're boys. Like, what, what's going on? Is, is mom and dad getting a divorce? Was it my fault? <laughs> I, I'm going I'm to I'm list off people on Discord whose fault it is that we're getting a divorce. Okay, <laughs> Narc, Coker, <laughs> uh, Milkman, Pedophile Gaming, uh, let's see, uh, Marshall, uh, Tommy. Ah, sick. Thaddeus, is trending the for most. The fucking a million Funny time man, a little Twitter. bit. And rage face, your leafy. Rage, hey, just no rage face the most. I'm sorry, rage face the most. Yeah, that's it. Your leafy. That's it. And maybe Amari a little bit. I'm gonna be honest. Amari a little bit. I will always say cancel culture discussion on on Twitter. Oh, is like scripted. The most. It's the most fucking toxic thing ever. Uh, it just it's it it's def it definitely sparks a heated debate around here because because mm. I of all people since I'm famous and all I fear it all the time. Very famous, very famous. I made eighteen dollars on Twitch, baby. Let's go, hush, little baby. Dark. I I guess it is the end of the episode. No, we still gotta talk about the baby. Come on, go on, say something about the baby, Harry. Uh, okay, so the baby, um. My I, my beef with him is that he he accused Leafy of grooming him as a child. <laughs> <laughs> the baby's so older a, than I'm Leafy. A, shut up, Austin. <laughs> okay, the baby groomed Leafy, and Leafy didn't like that. So he groomed. He didn't like Get it. Get me done. <laughs> that was that was his revenge. He was like, "Yo, yeah, this is why. This is why the baby. <laughs> Look what you made me do." Ooh, look what you made me do. <laughs> Dude. This is, we have fun here. This is cringe. Ah, uh, it's kind of cringe. Love Absolutely you guys. Absolutely cringe. We could, we could, we could, we could, um, we could, we could just like cancel Jason if you want. You're probably asking how we're going to do this. I'll tell you. So, do you know how he lives in the state of Wyoming? Yeah. Well, that should be enough. <laughs> yeah, well, I think we've already been over this. <laughs> okay, but seriously, Ari, say something about the baby and JoJo see why. I can really say truly is what the fuck? I am very confused. Th that's really all I can say. Like, why is he coming after JoJo see why? It doesn't really make sense to me. He is he though? I thought that he was like misheard. I mean, I, I, it's like one lyric. It was one lyric, but still doesn't make much sense to me. I thought he was saying like, "Yo, yo, see ya." Uh, okay. He said, "Fuck Jojo Siwa." 
or bitch or some shit like that. I think that was what it was. He said, fuck Jojo Siwa, bitch, or some shit like that. You know what? Maybe this wasn't such a good topic. I thought it was all right. Uh, Frost Drive asks, what hot takes do you guys have? Like actual opinions about things that most of society would disagree with. I think these are really interesting to hear. Do you have one? Hot takes on like life in general? Yeah. Um, hot take. Um, God was not very nice to me when it came to oh genetics. Oh my God. That's not what I'm pretty sure most take. of society will agree with you on that. <laughs> so that's not a hot take. <laughs> All right. How about this? How about this? I, how about this? Nurse Joy or Officer Jenny? I don't. I know neither. Is that from Pokemon? Harry? Yeah, that is from Pokemon. And Aunt Jemima. Ooh, my, I'd honestly my... say. <laughs> Officer Jenny. I'm going to look nice. up Officer Jenny, and I'll give my hot take, okay? Well, all uh, right. Uh, yeah. What I do y'all think about, uh, you know what, this is really rough. We need something, we need something, uh, we need a firebrand to burn this episode. I, I have a question um, what is that up? I picked out, that I picked out in the thingy. Uh, least slash, wait, hold on, before I even ask this, have you guys ever watched Power Rangers? Nah. Well, I'm I did as a real. kid. I don't remember it. I'm well, gonna be real. I only watched up, a few episodes with the uh, the cute yellow Power Ranger. <laughs> was she That's Asian? Yeah. It was asking uh, exactly. Because I, See, I, white power, is, black power. I don't know if it's yellow power. Well, oh, oh, whoa, dude, chill. I don't know if it's like. Hey, Jason made that joke first. He's the one that made it first. But anyway, I know he did. And yeah, she was actually Asian, and the Black Ranger was black. The yellow one was Asian, the white one. But anyways, go on. That is go on, please. Racist. Um, it is. I don't know if it's well known information, but um, I really do like Power Rangers. Like I've been a big fan of it for a while now. And um, this question is. I was surprised this was here, but it's asking for least slash most favorite version of the Power Rangers and why. And I'm gonna say the best version of Power Rangers is RPM. Um, RPM is really fucking good. If you guys want to know what kind of it's 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 simply like it's a basically a apocalypse. It's like the apoc like the apocalypse happened. Like legit, like the world has been nearly destroyed, and um, and the Power Rangers are the only people who can save the world. Well, not really. It's like a human. The human race has been severely, severely um shortened. Or, and now they have to live in a dome and they have to live in a dome that has like supports their eco like a, a whole ecosystem and shit like that you know and robots are basically ruling the the outer the outer perimeter and basically the robots want i don't know if they want to destroy I, yeah i'm pretty sure they want to destroy the dome and wipe out all of humanity and so the power rangers have to basically protect protect the protect the 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 dome and shit like that and it's just very it's just a very it's very dramatic it's like this is like a drama type shit like it's very dramatic there's a lot of really good story elements and it's just good i think it's like one of the most well-written versions of power rangers ever that's that's really it that's all i gotta say you guys fuck with water <laughs> yes I, I i desperately want to add this episode i'm not gonna See, lie that's where i disagree